kitchen it's almost Easter here and we have a little twist on an old favorite we're gonna make some chick deviled eggs and we're gonna color them now the coloring that I'm using is um just basic food coloring you get it in the little four pack in the store uh, and what I did is I put about a tablespoon of vinegar in here a half a cup of water and a few drops of food coloring and I used the basic colors yellow, blue, and red. And we can combine those if you want more than those three colors. And I have six hard boiled eggs. Um, boil your eggs the way you would normally boil them. And you can use your own deviled egg recipe for this, whatever you like. I just have some uh, whipped salad dressing here or something kind of like Miracle Whip. Uh, if you like mayonnaise, use mayonnaise. If you want something else in it, put that in it. You cut the top off the eggs. You don't want to slice them in the middle like you were making deviled eggs because we're going to make a little hat out of this part. Uh, scoop the yolk out. We're combining that with our salad dressing or mayonnaise, whatever you prefer. You can see I'm not cutting these in the middle, I'm cutting the fat end off. And that's going to be my lid. And I am using a sharp knife to do this because I don't want my uh, egg white to tear. Otherwise it won't look like a little chicken and egg. Okay, I'm going to take my egg halves and dip them down in this dye. And if you want, you can make dye for your Easter eggs, your hard boiled Easter eggs that you're going to do use for your egg hunt or whatever. You can make this, this same dye with food coloring and you can dye your Easter eggs that you're going to hide. You do not have to have a little kit. While those are dying, I'm going to mash up my yolk and my mayonnaise or salad dressing, whichever you prefer. If you want to, you can add salt, pepper, paprika, it's just whatever you prefer. Okay, while those sit just another second, we have a baby carrot here that I've cut up in little slivers to make the beaks out of, and a black olive that I've cut up in little bitty pieces, and we're going to make eyes out of that for our little chicks that are going to be in our eggs. Okay, we're just going to use a spoon to spoon back in our yolk. little eyes and it looks like there's a baby chick peeking out of her Easter egg and I got these little cardboard things out of a Easter egg dye kit you can uh, sit them in that you could cut the bottom off of an egg carton you could use that to display them but just anything to sit them up you do want to kind of sit these up because 
they're not going to look like chicks peeking out of eggs if they're laying on a plate. Okay, you got the idea there. It just takes a second to do something extra special with your deviled eggs this Easter. Thanks for joining us in the Hillbilly Kitchen again, and don't forget to click like, subscribe, and share.